Hi guys, welcome to Code Artisan Lab. This is video number 19 for Gym Management System in Django. And in this video, we are going to use Django signals. Okay. So, what is the Django signals? So, whenever we create the new, whenever we create the new instance of any model, then we can send the notification to our custom method. Okay. So, in this, uh, uh, with the help of signal, we send the notification. Okay. And we can perform the event at that notification okay so this is the this is the basic definition of the signal okay we actually signal describe signal word is described itself that whenever we create the instance of any model then we send the signal to another custom function okay and uh, at the various points we can send the signals like we are saving the whenever we create the uh, a model instance uh, whenever we uh, save the data in the model whenever we delete the data in the model okay so in the various points we can send signal to our custom function so today we will use the uh, we will use the post save uh, uh, a point so whenever we create the uh, new user whenever we sign up the new user then we will send we will save the subscriber also okay so if you remember that we have created the subscription and subscriber model so whenever we sign up then we will automatically uh, send the signal to the subscriber and it will save the user instance in the subscriber model okay so that we are going to use signal so this is just a basic definition of signal okay and uh, if you want to more explore about the signal then please go to the django official documentation they have described everything in a point to point and very beautiful manner okay so let's start to do this so the first thing what i will need to do we need to import the signals so i will import it from the so here i will do so here from django dot db dot models dot signals import post save okay so whenever we save the post we will you whenever we save the post we will use this signal and one thing more we need a dispatcher so django dot dispatch import receiver okay so in the in the signal functionality one is sender and another is receiver so receiver will be our custom function and sender will be from where from which point we are sending to the uh, signal our custom function so here the sender is user okay user model because in the sign up functionality we are using the user model so the user is receive uh, sender and our custom function is uh, receiver so how we can do that so after the subscriber model here i will create so here what i will do i will add the dispatch here and the first thing is we need to define that which point i want to send the signal and uh, who is the sender so sender will be our user model okay and here we will define the custom function so the function will be create subscriber okay and in this we need to define the multiple parameters okay so the first parameter is sender and the second parameter is instance okay and the third parameter is created and the fourth is keyword arguments okay so we will define that and here we will define if created it means if the user is new user is created if created then what we will do here we will subscriber so subscriber dot subscriber dot objects subscriber dot objects dot create okay and here we will pass the user instance okay so this is the instance that we are getting that as a user is sending okay so now uh, we are going to save this uh, whenever we uh, sign up this then uh, the subscriber should be created in the database okay so let's try this so i will go to here okay and let's create uh, let's open the 
another browser i will open firefox okay and let's open the admin here okay so i hope you understanding all the things that what i uh, what we are going to do okay why we are going to do this okay and if you have any doubt or any query then please add in the comment section okay and uh, uh, if you are new to this uh, channel then please subscribe this channel and uh, click on the bell icon so that you will get regular updates because we are we will do lots of projects okay i will upload lots of project uh, on the youtube channel and also you can see the uh, link on the you can see the projects on the github i have provided the link on the on my channel you can see that you can follow the instagram page facebook page okay okay so promotion is enough so let's uh, oh, let's focus on the things okay so where we are we were on the okay so here we have subscribers okay so let's go to the and let's uh, define the alex okay and uh, let's define the uh, some data define this username and password okay and let's submit this okay so thanks for register it means everything is working now let's go to the subscriber and refresh the page so it is saying that the image attribute has no file associated with it okay so here what it wants to say that we are showing the image of the subscriber in the list but we don't have image because when we are creating the subscriber on with the signal then we are just providing the user instance okay so how we can uh, resolve how we can resolve this error so what i will do here i will just simply self dot image if self dot image returns true then i will return this else else what i will do i will return no image okay just simple so refresh the page this this it is refreshing okay so here you can see that i am in the subscriber model and uh, we have created the user alex okay here so user is created and subscriber is also created without image you can update this data with the help of when you click on this so it is saying that subscriber object has no attribute subs because in the string we are returning the field that we have not created so i will just simply say use okay i am showing you the all errors because if you solve the error then you can become a very good developer okay so that we need to understand the error then we can solve the things okay first of all we need to understand the error or understand the questions okay so so here you can see that we have created the user and with the help of signals the we have created the uh, subscriber okay so in future maybe we will do lots of things with the signals okay and uh, in various points you can uh, define the signal pre po uh, post save pre save okay uh, before saving the data you can create the uh, you can send the notification to the custom function okay so so this is the thing that i want to show you that how we can use the signals this is the just a basic example okay so i hope you understand all the things all the uh, all all the things that i want to explain okay so if you have any query any doubt then please add in the comment section and uh, please like share subscribe this channel and uh, please like okay so thanks for watching this video thank you so much thank you